decades ago, every known star and habitable planet vanished, leaving only those who were on space stations or starships. This event became known as the Quiet Rapture, with supplies and dwindling, uh, <clears throat> with supplies dwindling and infrastructure crumbling. Survivors are searching for any trace of natural resources in a universe of barren moons lit by the ghost light of vanished stars. One such moon holds a strange anomaly, an ocean of blood. You are a convict tasked with exploring this anomaly in a makeshift submarine nicknamed the Iron Lung. It was not designed for the depth for this depth, so you will be welded inside. Holy shit. It was not designed for this depth, so you will be welded inside, and the forward window will be closed. There was no time for training. If successful, you earn your freedom. Oh, 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 what a premise. What a setup. What a setup. This is so metal. The quiet rapture. Roughly 40 seconds. Stand by. No, I'm, I'm very sorry. I'm going to start over right away. Because I missed literally the first word spoken. <laughs> Oh, Barlow, sci-fi horrors, great. Beginning at descent. Beginning descent. Cruising depth in roughly 40 seconds, stand by. Cruising depth in roughly 40 seconds. Um, I'm seeing some voltage irregularities in the instruments, so keep an eye out for sparks or flames or anything like that. Oh, cool. Voltage irregularities in the instruments. Keep an eye out for sparks and flames. Approaching maximum depth. Uh, the hole's feeling it, but it's still holding strong. Closing port hole shielding. Would you say it's holding strong? Oh my god, they just locked me in a... Lose radio signal. You'll be at cruise depth soon, so risk thing and be careful. You're on your own. Fuck. Oh my god. You're on your own. They locked me in a, a tin coffin and sent me off to die in a blood ocean. What do you do? Okay. Um, that is my only way of seeing outside, huh? I do anything? Is this like IRC commands or no? Okay, so I'm gonna hope that's just seaweed, but it looks pretty spooky when you just have this low res nothing photo with no light coming in. Okay, our oxygen is good at least. Uh, let's check the briefing. Two weeks ago, we conducted an exploration of Moon AT5 for the first time since the Quiet Rapture, leading to the discovery of a fourth blood ocean. There were three? A fourth blood ocean. A trench beneath the ocean surface has several points of interest. Your task is to photograph these, ten, uh, these points of interest with the SM-13's forward camera. Photos must be taken within two units of the specified position and 10 degrees of the specified angle. You can, you can also use the camera to help with navigation. Only photos taken at the specified points of interest will be saved. Since you can't navigate by sight, pay attention to your coordinates and consult the map. The proximity indicators next to the subcontrols will trigger if you're getting too uh, if you're getting close to an obstacle. Good luck. Oh, cool. So these are our points of interest then? 
Okay, so we have our Y, X. So then X, so 259, <clears throat> 406 would be something like 250-ish and then 406. Okay, I, I'm reading my map correctly. And then A? Oh, right, the angle. What the shit? Okay, uh, so first off, where am I? Okay, good, they do format it the same X, Y. I'm... Oh, that really provokes a lot of anxiety. First off, what do these do? What can I do? Let's just play around real quick. Why did that save? Okay. Oh, wow, you really hear it, even when you're just spinning in place. Okay, so that's my angle. And then... I really just have forwards and backwards plus setting my angle. Okay. Wow. Alright, so where am I? Where am I heading? Uh, 184 and 120 should put me around... Uh, uh oh. Okay. And then I'm gonna head something like north with a slight drift towards the northeast. And I'm just gonna go until I hit a wall. That was not the wall I was actually expecting to come close to. And the closest one to me would be still a bit further north. Okay, now we're at 186. And then I think we're going to have to start turning pretty sharply. Oh, shit. How close can I get to those? Okay. Good enough. That's a little spooky. Is it heading towards me? No, I must be following the wall. Three twenty two, one eighty six. Pretty soon, I'm going to need to start drifting a little bit back to the north. Yeah, there is something that's that's really soothing about this until something disturbs the 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 status quo of the ambience, Rosen. <clears throat> then it becomes kind of alarming. Oh hey Arth. Uh Arth says evening everyone. Rimworld Rim World has announced a new expansion that'll add children. There will be cross expansion interaction, and the previous expansion introduced slavery. Rimworld is going to make me face a lot of things. <laughs> what was that? Uh, yeah, Arth is going to have a, a crisis of child slavery, and I'm going to get killed by a kraken? Question mark? Or, or something much worse. Nope, oh, oh, oh.
I just want to make sure it's not approaching me. It's the crab you didn't catch. Damn it. Whoop. Should be able to just wiggle my way in here. Oh, maybe not. We get between these? Oh, God! That is so loud. Okay, that tells me a lot about my proximity sensors. Oh, my shit. Ooh. That scared the bejesus out of me. Yeah, the answer is I could not get between those. Okay, 322 by 186. Maybe I need a more shallow angle. This is telling me I need a more shallow angle. Or I will hit a wall again. I will have egg on my face a second time. God. It's just it it's garbage image. It the only thing this can do is scare you. <laughs> it can only scare you. It can never help you. It can just imply something terrible is nearby. But is that fungible information for me? I don't think so. Whoop, that is though. We're funging, we're funging. We're funging the information. What the shit? Oh, no, no, no. Bad, 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 bad. I'm a little off course. Still, we will press on. Gotta go a little bit to the northwest. Oh! Shall we play this game again? This time, I think I will find a use for the camera. That can't possibly... Right? This... The, the kelp cannot possibly be death. Right? No, the kelp was death. <laughs> Everyone called it. Okay, now we know that this kelp means death. Behind the kelp was a wall. Tricky ocean blood planet hiding all of its walls behind kelp I 
I wish it didn't reset your cursor. That's kind of annoying. Okay. So I'm... Okay. I think... Let me double check the Y. Is that 118? Yeah. Okay. So if I go straight east, I will die. So I need to go north and then hang a right. La Lijo. Wait, is that a JoJo's laugh, or is, am I thinking of the the Lollafells? Okay, so from here, I think is where I need to turn hard right. Should be ninety degrees. Just about, somewhere around there. Oh, I'm gonna have to skirt that a little. I think that should be uh, like this ridge that I'm getting around, I hope. Should be good enough. What's going on in the sub? Uh, the sub is very normal. There's a camera, a computer that I cannot use, uh, and an open blood ocean ahead of us. Lolly ho. Okay, I think this is 322 we're looking for, so we're coming up on it. I think I want the Y to be 186, so that has to go down a little. I think we're smooth sailing ahead. Yeah, we should be just about perfect. Pretty close, pretty close. 322. Need to go down what? Nine more. Okay, and then this also has to be the right angle. Uh, 33 degrees. Way too far. Okay, and this is a front-facing camera, so... Getting... What the shit? Is it moving? Not a fan. Oh good, it's checked. Okay, so from here, uh, I just want to be heading northeast a little bit. Fuck. Yeah, like 30, 33 degrees, somewhere around there. Oh, 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. I just need to get... I, I just need to wrap my head around navigating this way. It's pretty fun, actually. Three seventy eight, three seventy eight, two sixty three. I'm getting pretty close. There you are. It should be passing by the front. What in the world? I was better off not seeing that. Uh, the schedule is on the Twitch page itself. It's the built-in Twitch schedule thing. Okay, so what is it? 263? Yes. So I think 90 degrees should do it. Oh wait. Nope, 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 nope. wrong way I think we can be I think we can be like 0.8 degrees off 50 can't be that far off can't tell if it's bones or really just kelp or coral. I got it. Oh, this one's going to be tricky. Let's see. How do I want to set my heading? Probably close to shit. Yeah, close to shit. Probably around 325, 330-ish. What I wouldn't give for a sextant. I don't know if that's the instrument I want, but what I wouldn't give for one. Absolutely hate that. Should I, when I hear that, should I slow down or even stop in place to not provoke something? Oh shit, it's leaking. That can't be good. Oh well. Not my problem today. Wait. Am I coming up against this? Was my angle too sharp or too shallow? Yeah, I should be coming up on this. Oh, my angle is still bad. Okay, we want 259 by 406. So I want to start heading north. Okay, can I get it this time? Nope. Oxygen. 
notification. What? Oh my god, I'm, am I on a timer? Yeah, I, I, that was gonna have to become relevant sooner or later. Oh shit. Wait, what? What am I gonna, what am I running into? Unless I'm still here. Which would mean I'm further south than I thought I was. Fifty nine. I got a little ways to go. I still have to go north a little bit too. Uh, no, Arth, don't tell me. No, I didn't want anyone to actually answer that. That was rhetorical. Thank you, though. Uh, four oh six. We're getting there. And then also, I'm pretty close. No, I'm not. fuck is that? Sounds like there's a storm. Yeah, it's coming from over there, though. 259406. I hate these noises. I hate them so much. Okay, 291. So, uh oh. I want to be heading a little bit this way. bringing that number way down. I'm gonna power through. I'm just gonna power through. What could, what's the worst that could happen? Is, or is, am I crazy or is this getting redder and rustier? Is the light starting to go? Am I getting paranoid? I don't know. Wait, did I pass it? Yep, 259, back up, backing up. Backing up, backing up, backing up, backing up. And we're good. 259, 406. Then the angle was 296. It is leaking and it is a blood ocean. Yeah. Concerns. Let's see if it's moving. It's not. It's stationary. Is it worse that it's stationary? That it's just like that? Okie dokie. Back the way we came, hopefully. It's gonna be a little tricky, but we got here. Okay, that 
means I should be getting around here. Okay, good. That means I should have just crossed the street around here, I think. And that means, in a moment, when I get out into the open, I should be able to now just head here. And whenever I get the proximity alarm, I should be somewhere in this area. Hmm? How incorrect was I? Okay, let's 309 by 333. That can't be right. That can't be right. Is that completely correct? Oh, it is. I wasn't, ah. Uh. Okay, I hadn't traveled as far as I thought. Trying to get the hang of navigating this is pretty fun. Oh, staple gun. That's a really interesting idea. I want this as co-op where the other person sees the map while you just steer with the current positioning. Yeah, kind of like, um, Kind of like a keep talking and nobody explodes kind of setup. Ah, I really like that. I really like that idea. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's good. That's really good. Keep talking and no one draw. <laughs> Keep talking and no one drowns in the blood ocean. Okay, good, 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 good. Now we can start heading north. Bye! And then just head a little bit. Uh, that means here. Oh, no, 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 south a little bit and then left and maybe yeah maybe give this a little pass 180 so I can give it kind of a berth yeah 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 okay I'm working on like look around a little there though we're in there what the sh oh god damn it oh it's falling apart
Okay. I hope that means that I am in this straight. Okay. No kelp ahead. Oh, good, 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 good. Just got a saving progress. Yeah, the sub is falling apart pretty quick. 433 by 320. 433-ish by, they say 320? Yes. 433, 320. Okay, so I need to head a little bit further southeast. Five sixty two seventy seven. God, this thing is falling apart. Five sixty two seventy seven. Okay, we have a good heading. Oh, also, thank you for putting that in chat's table. That makes it easier on me. I keep um, forgetting it when I get distracted by something spooky. <laughs> of the steam I thought was getting louder. Why music now? I don't know why I'm looking around like this, like I can go anywhere. What the sh... No, 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 no. Oh, God. That was something enormous passing by. About seven o'clock on the ship. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Now we can go straight south, I think, which is 180. It's 560, yeah? Yeah. I mean, that's fine. Pretty sure 559.99 is fine. Forty three degrees. Oh, hello, Lalafell. 
Uh, hey, I don't know if this has ever been answered before, but how come you don't do LPs with Mike anymore? Um, it has, but I will answer it again. No particular reason, really. Uh, he just got really busy at one point and kind of burned out on the LPs, so... Meh. Just... Uh, stop doing them together. I should say, we're, we're still friends. <laughs> Does it have a face? Oh my god, I think... No, is that pattern-seeking brain, or is that face? Paradolia? Or... Oh, this one moves. This one's definitely moving. Maybe not. Maybe it's just the ocean current. Yeah, that's Paradolia. Yeah, I think that was Paradolia. It's just from the way the particles in the blood ocean are. Nah, that wasn't a face. I see no face. No face. Varys says it could be a sideways Amogus. Oh no. Blood Amogus. Who are you trying to convince? I'm not trying to convince anyone. It's not a face. It's There's no face there. You're being tricked. Well, whatever that was, was small enough that it didn't register on the proximity sensor. Alright, where are we actually heading? 613 by 197. Already hit our lateral heading. 197, yes. Looks like we kind of get two freebies back to back. 197, back up, back up. Our angle is 55. That's definitely a big skeleton. I was kind of thinking the second one that we saw looked like a rib cage. That's for sure a skeleton. And yes, this one, absolutely a face. So what we've been seeing are not tendrils, they're bones. Oh my god, they're human teeth. Wait, they're human teeth. What the? F it's like a T-Rex with human teeth and a, a very strange protrusion. Is that, oh my God, is that that fish with the human teeth? Yeah, I mean, flat 
teeth like that do indicate it's an herbivore. That is a good observation. But at the same time, there is that one very creepy fish that has human-looking teeth. And, mm, I don't like it. Yeah, that's a much better question, is what would prey on something that size? I mean, maybe it just died of natural causes and decayed at the bottom of the ocean, the blood ocean. However... Yeah, we're just gonna hit, like, open ocean for a good long while. want to be hitting like 800 on the x-axis yes Rosen asks another good question how many pathogens are in that blood ocean I didn't make it in time the hissing leak stopped? No, it didn't. I'm afraid not. I'm not afraid of it. It can't hurt me. Eight sixty four two fifty eight. So I just went head straight north. Zero degrees. Z Zero. Come on. Can I get yeah, point one's fine. Oh wait, whoa, 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 whoa. hold on. What's in front of me? Unpleasant. So wait, where am I actually? I'm at 754-270. I'm... Oh. 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 So I still need to go further east. I don't know why I thought I was good there. Just want to make sure. Okay. That's a little spooky, just that one piece of kelp. Who knows? This submarine is pretty trash. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please don't break down on me again. <gasps> So that means, okay, okay. This is a really, really narrow one. Saw that progress save. Uh, 864 258. Uh, I need to go, I think, southeast a little. Maybe even. I 
don't think it's going to pass in front of the camera like that. No. Okay. What the shit is this sound now? Eight sixty two sixty. I'm actually pretty close to where I need to be. In fact, sixty four. And then 258? Yeah. You hit 90 degrees and then back up. Wait. No, no, no. I keep mixing that up. Let me hit 180. I don't care about you right now, Whale. Um, I see a tree stump or a pit. This is a real uh, uh, Rorschach test. Often. That does count. I could get a little closer. Okay. That doesn't clarify things at all. Gonna <laughs> very carefully backtrack our way out of here. Finishing school says it's a coffin with windows, as opposed to what I'm in, which is a coffin without windows. Uh oh. Does that mean I'm coming up on this or this? I guess we'll see if there's something directly. Whoa. spooky for a second. Yeah, a coffin with a camera on the outside. 800 by 300. I'm right here, so I want to head southwest a little bit. Especially until that one stops. When that stops, then we just change our heading to about 270, cruise for a bit, uh, make a hard right, 360 degrees or zero and we should be good to go
wait a minute. That's a little too close. It's a little too close. Little, 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 little bit too close. Oh, Jesus. It's just falling apart. Let me head back to around, um, I want to hit like 550 by 250. Then I'll head north. What the sh fuck? Yeah, there's something really pleasant about it. Like, it's just giving me dopamine, Rosen, and occasionally scaring me. Yeah, it is a really good atmospheric uh, exercise, Lollapel. Oh, oh, oh. Like, it's the definition of doing a lot with a little. That is 480, 380. Okay, we've gone a little bit. We finally hit the northern wall. Or at least the northern wall of this little section. I don't know what's going to happen when we have to hit these three. There's some kind of fog of war. <laughs> Low down there. Who's tetanus? What tet? Oh! Ace says, I love the fact that it looks like this sub is absolutely covered in tetanus. Uh, to which... Oh, that was a continuation from that sense. Okay, yeah, that seems to be the through line with all the Hollow Month games so far as tetanus. Yeah, that's... The tetanus is gonna continue. Tetanus will continue. Knowing what's on the schedule, tetanus is going to continue. Good. That's what I wanted to see. Oh, 
Okay, co uh, good. So now we're crossing that street. One tricky part done. This is kind of out in the open. And then we have the fun part. Uh, Lollafell, I'll probably stream it. I don't know. I I have to see what I'm... <gasps> oh, there it is again. Six twenty three by five twenty. Yeah, me too, Rye. I, I desperately hope it's good too. No, that thing was way too fast for a picture, Solar. This one go hard 90 degrees. And then I have to go just a little south. Oh, oh, oh. Little far, little far. And my angle is 63. Well... less and less ambiguous. Hmm. No, that was bone for sure. It's definitely bone. Just, it's very long. And it just keeps going. And there's more behind it. This is a graveyard. Wait, what? Okay, that's alarming. What is that? Okay, just kelp. Okay, okay. Now... I mean, maybe we just had... Northeast. Just very slightly northeast. I'm gonna try to. What is in front of me? Am I gonna collide with the bone? That's so unpleasant. Like every 
every single one of those is an opportunity for just a little jump scare, just a little, a little surge of alarm through your amygdala. All right, so what is the, what are the coordinates I'm trying to enter this from? About 750 by 650. 75650. Easy to remember. Maybe that won't work. Backing up, backing up, backing up, back, uh, backing up. More kelp. active around here. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm guessing more kelp. Yeah, Rosen, I definitely hear more than one. Maybe I can't get through that way. Uh, I'm going to try over here. Although, I'm not exactly sure where I've worked myself into. There we go. Six thirty by five forty. Oh, so I'm back where I started there about. And how is there something? Is it the bones again? Yeah, it's got to be the bones. Bones are a little in front of me. Just a little bit. went too far. I, ah, I was trying to ease in. Wow, that scared the hell out of me. me back before the point of interest okay 623 by 520 and I'm at oh that put me back quite a bit Whoa, whoa. Oh, that's a critter.
That's a critter. enough sixty three good got it again now we will head right back around, around 270. Yeah, I imagine not calamity. I imagine it doesn't taste great. You are correct. God. One of the whales is playing music. to get um latitude is yeah lateral latitude I'm looking to get around the 300s for my latitude before I do anything else I was, ah, oh shit. I was just about to say, uh, crashing and reloading fixed, uh, all the, the steam pipes leaking and the console exploding, but I have way less oxygen to play with now. So I'm like 400 by 500 right now. Which means I'm pretty close to this, so I want to start heading north. Just hard north, maybe very slight drift northeast, like three or four degrees. Maybe grab a picture. What is the console about? Is that for just post game secrets? <laughs> Something about this is alarming or suspicious or amogus. Okay. Okay. 394 by 550. Uh, 550, 394, that's basically 400. Whoops. Maybe a little. A little bit like this. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're slipping. Uh, 
Uh, hopefully we're slipping between this little narrow stretch. We're getting through. The feed is more gnarly and distorted than it was before. Okay. Okay, we're through. We are through. Okay, let's head to... Uh, let's get this one out of the way first. 324 by 741. What is oh my god um um uh oh shit come on oh. get go out ah oh my god this sucks oh my god this sucks God. Oh wait, did that dislodge the manual? Let me... This is not an expedition. It's an execution. When they put you in here, they don't want you to return. And even if you do, and even if they keep their promises, what freedom waits for you? A few dying ships and a sea of dead stars? If there is still hope, it lies beyond the veil. Hope in this void is as illusionary as the starlight. I will choose to breathe my last here at the bottom of an ocean, unseen, unheard, and uncontrolled. They'll get their execution. I'll get my freedom. No, that fire's not coming back. Fuck off. It's just that one page. You couldn't have left me a document on how to operate the console, please? Yeah, that surely did eat up some oxygen, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Oh, are those fish? Oh, do I have to put this back? Yeah, okay. Okay, where was I going? Uh, 325, 741. Yeah, I have a good heading. 741, 741. Should be able to beeline right to it. Unless I see saving progress in the bottom right of my screen. <laughs> oh, 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 going too far. Going too far north now. I'm good north. Means I just have to go a little bit west. Three twenty-five. And our angle is eighteen degrees. What do we got? Oh, I hate that. Let's kind of pan from side to side.
How long is this? I think that's around the original. No, that's twice the original angle almost. Is that a face? All right, let's head back to the Southwest. Yeah, you're probably right about that, Anna Insomnia. I think it's the same kind of skull as before. Yeah, it just seems like we're looking at it from a lower angle this time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are we going into? Ah, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Should be good. Oh, wait, was that one in front of us? Hold on. No. Still many concerning things happening. God, that's going to be a pain in the ass to get in and out of. I'm just sailing on vibes right now. Um, I want to get... First, I want to get somewhere around... 250 by 650. That's my first goal. 250 by 650. We have a good heading for that. 250 by 650. And we have an auto save. Perfect. Good. Exactly what I'm looking for. Kind of. Close enough. Good, 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 good. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is sketchy, but like this is a tight corridor no matter what, so it was always going to be sketchy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Good night, Rosen. Now, 200 by 650 ish. 200 by 650. Wait, do I have that right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. So now. Clench in for the boom. Ah, uh, there's not going to be a boom. Well. Do you believe in the power of a curse? We're at 250, 200 by 650 again. 250 by, uh, 200 by 650. 200, 650. So wait, what in the world is in my way? That shouldn't be kelp or a wall. Huh. Shouldn't be in front of me anymore. Okay. 
We're okay. We're just heading into another narrow part. I should start rounding that curve a little bit. Oh my god. Again. Yeah, the noise is really unsettling right now. It's just the groaning of the hull. Okay, what do I want to hit? I want to hit 180 by 576. noises as well. Oh my god, what the hell is about to happen? I feel like my panel is about to explode. Oh my god! <laughs> The hole? Hmm. Phobia. Oh, phobia bathroom hole. Yeah. 18576. It's getting more intense. They want me to get right next to it. 18576. Crikey. And the angle. Oh, I. Yeah, that's it. So. Uh. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Let's get away from it. Oh good, the shaking got less intense. What the fuck? That sounded like a sucker from an octopus tentacle latching onto the ship. This time? No. Yay, saving progress. Once you get the hang of this, it's really, really, really satisfying and kind of chill. Okay. Uh, where are we? We are almost 400 by 700. So we are smack dab in the middle of this mass of ocean floor. And we want to keep heading due east.
and then we'll probably be going southeast a little bit. Or 50 by 700. as much progress as expected. That's the one thing that... Oh! oh! Jesus! It did some kind of damage. Yeah, I was like, that has to be something, because I knew there couldn't be anything in front of me. Holy shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, what do you... Is it, is it back? No, I think this is just solid kelp. Yeah. I'd buy 700. I'd buy... 700. Oh, this, this ambient music is funky too. I like it. Uh, good thing we're close to the end. Yeah, we have a- the leak is getting bad. Leak is becoming a problem. Okay, I'm hoping that means I'm here, but I don't think I am. I think I'm further south. Six by 750. Six by 750. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I am closer than I thought. Or rather, my estimate is is actually pretty close. So what are we looking for? We're looking for 675 by 828. 675, 828. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, it's filling up really goddamn fast. This is getting bad. I'm not gonna be able to steer in a second. Oh, shit. Um, 675, 828, 675, 828. Come on. I can't be that close to it, right? Shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa.
Okay. 675. Okie dokie. Now hit 90 degrees. No, wait. This needs to be south. This is uh, north south. So 180, 180, 180, 180. And then 828. We can back it on up like this, it's fine. 828, 828, 828, 828, 828, 828, 828, 828, my prediction, really quick, is that we're going to snap this picture, uh, and whatever it is, is going to immediately eat us, and that's going to be credits. 295. Oh my god! It was even better than I thought it was going to be. They were one step ahead of me. Oh, that's so perfect. The expedition ultimately raised more questions than answers. Satellite images showed pieces of the SM-13 scattered all over the bottom of the trench, as though it had been torn apart by some huge beast. The wreckage cannot be reached at this time. No photographs have been recovered. The stars shine pale as bones. The moon is a lifeless corpse, its ocean a gaping wound. The universe, what's left of it, is dying. But somewhere in the void, there must be hope. Dave, there's extra lore. Yeah, I kind of figured, since we found no uses for the console. What if I hit continue? Solar says, I still really wonder if there's a different ending for going uh, to the canyon as your last picture and flying into the warpy thing. Ah, there we go. You just type lore words into the computer and it tells you about it. In three fep in. Is that EIC? In 357 EIC, without any prior warning, radio contact with our respective planets was suddenly cut. Nobody can recall having visual contact with any planets when the incident occurred or experiencing any other unusual phenomena. So it's uncertain what exactly might have happened. Upon investigation, it was observed independently by several stations that where they had, where there had been uh, planets previously, nothing remained. Further investigation over the following months revealed that all known planets with sentient life, flora and fauna, a habitable atmosphere, or any sort of natural resources were likewise gone along with all known stars. The only celestial bodies that have been found since are either uninhabitable moons or asteroids. Many theories have been proposed for this disaster, including religious interpretations of it as a literal rapture some unknown quantum anom anomaly or something more cosmic and sinister. There are no concrete answers yet. Check anglerfish? Okay. Unknown query. Blood ocean. Blood ocean. Oh yeah. Blood ocean is an unexplained phenomenon that's been identified on four separate moons since the Quiet Rapture. Uh, moon AT5, Moon Z8 are the most notable locations as they're under the control of the COI. 
Enough research has been conducted on the blood itself to determine that it's indeed human blood. Oh, okay, so it's from everyone that got raptured. But we have not discovered where it comes from or how it keeps its liquid form. The ocean on AT5 is of particular interest because redacted. This entry has been redacted. See blood oceans. What about moon at AT5? Moon Z8. One of two such moons under the control of the COI. Historically been used for the realization of COI con of COI convictions until the discovery of Moon 85. COI. The Consolidation of Iron. Oh, this sounds fascist shit. The Consolidation of Iron is a brotherhood of three space stations and two spacecrafts found on the principal... Uh, oh, wow, it's the... Is it the opposite? Oh, it might be the opposite. Wow. Okay. Two spacecrafts found on the principle of collectivism and ruled by the popular vote of all citizens. Numbering... Oh, 257 at the time of this entry. Its name comes from the iron and steel materials its two main stations are constructed from, and the principle of unity and togetherness in the face of menace from other surrounding stations, stations such as Eden. Mmm. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah. On one hand, they're sending convicted prisoners to die uh, in the blood ocean. And what they say they are for is collectivism and uh, direct democracy. Hmm. Eden. Space Station Eden is the largest man-made structure that still exists in the wake of the Quiet Rapture. It was formerly the main station for Mars, and the populace still maintain a strong sense of Martian patriotism and independence, making them a constant threat to the sanctity and security of the COI. It has a current population of 468 and has the only known remaining trees in its interior garden. Fourth planet from the sun and the site first off earth uh, the site of the first off earth colony in 1992 AD 0 EIC Mars was most pop uh, Mars was the most populated planet in the solar system before the quiet rapture. Hmm. Surpassing Earth in 143 EIC. Now all that remains of Mars's former glory is the Eden space station. Epoch of Interplanetary Colonization. Uh, okay. Epoch of Interplanetary Colonization, or EIC, is an interstellar calendar standards standardization adopted with the establishment of the first off-Earth colony on Mars in 1992 AD. Uh, it was and is the predominant calendar used throughout the known galaxy, although before the Quiet Rapture, many debated switching over to a more standardized measurement of years. IMC, or Interstellar Martian Calendar, was especially popular owing to a large population residing on Mars. After the Quiet Rapture, all stations and starship alliances still use EIC, aside from Eden, which uses IMC. Interstellar Martian Calendar, known commonly as IMC, the Interstellar Martian Calendar is an alternative 
to the more widely used EIC, it was, po it was poised to be officially adopted by Mars before the Quiet Rapture, whereas EIC is based on the rotation of Earth, IMC is based on the rotation of Mars, meaning that one year in IMC is about 1.88 years in IMC? I think there's a little typo. Uh, currently, only Eden, a former Martian space station, uses IMC. Okay. What about Filament Station? Filament Station was the fourth and largest space station in the COI until 362, when tensions between the COI and Eden erupted in a nine-day battle on the station. The conflict, uh, the conflict battle ended unresolved when Eden troops resorted to sabotaging the station's Recator? Recator? Hmm? resulting in a critical breach. Redacted, the breach left Filament Station uninhabitable due to high levels of radiation, and it has sat empty since. Prisoners taken during the conflict have been undergoing conviction realization in the year since, uh, with the final ones expected to repay their debts and integrate into COI society by 381. Whoop. Fiction realization. Oh, wait, was the Recator supposed to be reactor? Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, conviction realization. What? A humane form of criminal justice used by the COI where crimes are repaid by rendering services to the general collective. Often this is by performing surveys, maintenance, or other similarly beneficial tasks. Okay. So I was essentially sentenced to community service, um, but whoever sentenced me has it out for me and wanted me to die. Or it was state. It was just a state-sanctioned execution, and this is how they uh, they present it to the public. Especially judging by that letter that we found earlier, like we are being sent one way or another. We were sent here to die. These are all the, the terms that the community has found so far. Interesting. Implying there might be more? What about our ship? SM-13. One of four in-service underwater crafts fashioned by the COI for use in conviction realization in the blood oceans. It's designed for deep liquid photography and analysis. Oh, all rumors of the SM-13 and similar crafts being used for so-called mob justice by way of forced suffocation or otherwise have been proven false. Have they? <laughs> yeah, so we're just sent to die by the state. Yeah, I'm looking through the wiki for other terms that we can check. Do we do SM8? Hopefully they don't redact this before updating the database. What most people don't understand is that not all subs are built equal. The SM-8 isn't a burner sub. It really is for exploring and surveying blood oceans. If they send you down in the iron lung, they don't give a fuck if you come back, or if the sub comes back because it's a pile of garbage and you're a piece of shit. You come back with photos, great. You sit down there, uh, you sit down there and suffocate quietly, even better. But if they send the SM-8 down, one of the scientists is piloting, 
and they all expect them to return. And now the SMA is in the blood ocean in pieces. No, not hit a rock pieces or sprung a leak pieces. It looks like something tore it up. And the weirdest thing is that nobody else seems surprised. We might have found the first planetary life since the rapture, and they're acting like it's no big deal. I know you're next in line for the realization in the, in the Iron Lung, and usually that means you won't be seeing the stars again. But they don't have an but they don't have an SMA anymore. They have three burner subs and a lot of curiosity about AT5, and maybe that means you have a chance. Oh, cool. So it's looking like there might be a way there might be an alternate ending. Ooh. Redacted, if you type monster. What about alien? Fish. Whoa. Discoveries on moon AT5. Oh, yeah. Behavior warning. The COI expects everyone in the collective to maintain a standard of polite and acceptable behavior. Please consider your language and attitude before interacting. Thank you. What if I get a lot of behavior warnings? I thought they might self-destruct the ship. A live fish creature. A live fish. All redacted creature. Uh, it's looking like that's it. As far as I can see. So everyone, this has been Iron Lung. What a short and sweet and, and incredibly interesting game. That got a lot of spooks out of me. A masterclass on atmosphere and doing a lot with a little. Hey, Future Dave here. I'm going to cut in just before Past Dave politely requests that you take it easy and have a good one. Because I would like to express my gratitude to my $10 and up patrons for my favorite month of the year. So thank you to Cinderland Akramlam, Glenn Mullen, Alpratenful, Victor T, Sad Salad Dressing, Evan, Kyle, Absinthe Miasma, Caesar Zamudio, Chris Makesner Croft, Ditlutz, Cleric Beastie, Dr. Rosen, Moody, Not a Tick with Wi Fi, Spectre Haven, Wi Fi, Wolfman 500, Cracky, and Sam. Thank you all so, 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 so much. Uh, as a quick related aside, my patrons are a large part of why Halloween can happen every year. It's actually not super cheap to put these together. First and foremost, because of how many games I have to pick up for it. Uh, so again, thank you to all my patrons so, so much. Uh, and also a very special thank you to Past Dave, even though he hasn't given me $10 this month. Uh, back to him. Uh, so thank you all for coming out tonight. Take it easy. Have a good one, y'all.